Hey guys, it's Project Slimy, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Silver. And in this part, we're just gonna blast through these rockets. I'll just show this one fight so I can say I actually fought in this episode. Uh, how boring, blah 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 blah. Okay, yeah, I, kn I know, that's pretty much your job, is to not train your Raticate or whatever the fuck you have, and just hang out. Oh, you have an Arbok. Okay, I guess they're mixing it up a little, but... Pretty much, it's nothing really new, to be honest. And I'm gonna shit all over this thing. It's probably gonna poison me, but who cares? Haha, uh -huh. you didn't get to paralyze me. Hey, maybe this is the same chick I- Oh, you dirtbag. You know what? You can bite me, that's fine. Oh, don't tell me we're gonna- I saw this one Let's Play, the fucking guy, he was paralyzed like five times in a row, something like that. Just to, just to piss you off, bro. I just, I just like being mean to people. There was really no reason for me to put him to sleep, I just felt like it. <laughs> you know what you do on to me, I'm gonna do on to you, that's what I do. Eye for an eye, motherfucker. Dude, I have six poke- Oh, are you kidding me? Well, I was wrong. He wasn't gonna- Don't tell me. Mm -mm. No way. You are not winning this fight. You are not winning this fight. I don't care. Yeah, see? See? You're dead. Maybe you should have went to college. Or something, because, I mean, you're still young, you're probably like my age. Okay, I'm just gonna cut out all these fights. I have the freaking like, six Rabbitatas. Go figure. Alright guys, five Rabbitatas. Wow. Yeah, see, this is, this is what, probably why Team Rocket keeps failing. You guys realize that, right? Right? Yeah, okay, get your fucking Rattata out of here. The gerbil Pokemon. Okay, yeah, I know, you're just a grunt, dude. Okay? Don't get all butt hurt. Here we go again. I had two Zubats. What a threat. What a threat. Hey, at least I'm getting a lot of lunch money. I just walk around in the game for like $25,000 in cash on me because I don't want to give it to my mom because she keeps spending it. <laughs> okay, come on, come on. Alright, I'm cutting out now. Oh, that guy's a trainer. Wait, no he's not. Oh, my bad. One of these guys is a trainer. And he's like... Looking around like insane. Yeah, that guy's a trainer. That's what I thought. That girl's not gonna fight you. Okay. And and this guy, let me guess, he has magnemites, doesn't he? He's probably gonna have like three of them, probably a Voltorb or something retarded like that. Or perhaps a Grimer. I'm just curious. Yep, told you so. Okay, cutting. Right, it's all the same level. Pathetic. Sand slash tried to use, uh, Sandy tried to learn uh, Swift right there. I didn't take it though. I don't need Swift. I work around those challenges. Okay, cutting out now. Dude, look at me. Oh yeah. By the way, guys, we have to rescue the director of the radio tower. I don't know why. Apparently he's kept hostage somewhere. But yeah, I don't know, I really like the theme though. Like the music inside, like at this part of the game, it's like really like intense. And I'm gonna cut now, because this guy has like three Zubats, probably. Okay, let's switch back to Sandy really quick, because we all know what this guy has. We've seen it plenty of times. Don't tell me I'm gonna get all this done in one video. That'd be ridiculous. 
Okay, cutting. This guy actually has a Porygon. Pretty interesting. Oh, shit. Alright, you slash. Boom. Dead. Dead. I've never used Porygon e either. I don't think he's really that great, to be honest. Okay, whatever. Get out of my face. I don't want to talk to you. Oh. Is this the boss room? Okay, guys, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, let's talk to the director. You came to rescue me? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. All the old guys look the same, besides Professor Rope. Dude, you know I'm gonna beat you. Okay, I got seven badges. Go away. Okay, and you have like level 20 Pokemon. Oh wait, no, you're legit. You got... Okay, this... Well, yeah, this guy's legit. Alright. Go to sleep, and we're gonna switch. Or actually, no, let, let's see where this goes. Heck, this ain't going so well so far. So far, this is not going so well. Come on! Should have just used fly. But I don't feel like waiting two turns just to hit him once. The coughing has like major high defense, so you know what? I'm gonna fly because I have a feeling he's gonna use self destruct when he wakes up. <laughs> Oh no, you sludge. See, if I was in this predicament, I would just use self-destruct, because it does ridiculous amount of damage. I mean, he's gonna die anyway, you know? And he has another coughing. Oh my god, dude. And let me guess, it's level 30, just like your first one. You know, you guys are really good at putting together parties. I wonder why you keep beating, getting beaten. I mean... Really? 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 Okay, come on, come on. I'm like tapping Z. Or what would be on the Game Boy A. Constantly. I'm trying to get past this guy. Come on. Swear to God. Okay. Okay. I can deal. Something different. And it's just two coffins attached to each other anyway. So technically, technically it's the ones, it's like what we just went through. So it should be that hard. Oh, and what to get, guys? Um, in third gen. Wow. You should have just used self destruct, you idiot. And watch, now he's going to use self destruct. But yeah, he's. He doesn't have levitate in this game, guys. That kind of stuff doesn't come until the third generation. All those abilities and shit, like steel and stuff. Or, I forget what that ability is, when you find shit on the ground. Oh, I'm getting tired! Okay, yeah, another level 30 coffin. When is this gonna get interesting? I'm just digging a hole. This guy ain't doing jack shit. He's just sending out all these goofy ass looking Pokemon. Come on. Come on. Throw out something interesting. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I, sh I should have just cut out this fight. This is pathetic. This is pathetic. Am I too close to my mic? I may be. Oh, I might just be. Come on. Come on. Send out something cool. Wow, really? Is this even worth showing? Well, I guess so, since you're like this big, bad goofhead. Frickin' douche canoe over here for sure. <laughs> he has one wheezing, and then the rest are just fucking level 30 coffins. I remember him... Who had, like, the Houndoom and the... 
you know, that is something someone should have if they're an executive. I mean, they just gave him fucking coffins. It's like a peasant. Are you kidding me? We stashed the real director in the underground warehouse. It's at the far end of the underground, but I doubt you'll get that far. Okay, we got a basement key. Um, okay, there's nothing else to, to do here. So guys, I will meet you in the underground. And oh, I remember this place. This is where I took oh, Obsidian for his millions and millions of haircuts. Oh shit, you know what? I'm gonna go heal. I'll be right back. Dude, really, what is the point in even blocking this shit off? Honestly, you see, now they're just cock blocking everything. Guys, let's head this way. Let me switch. Because I wanna. Okay, cool. Never mind. That's who I wanted to use. And over here, you get a little door. The basement key, open the door. Cool beans. And this puzzle is annoying. And what the hell? It's Lindsay! Hold it. I saw you, so I tailed you. You tailed me? I don't need you underfoot while I take care of Team Rocket. Since when are you a good guy? You friggin' you start the game off stealing, then and then you friggin' jump me, and now you wanna, you know, kill your comrades. Well, I don't know, because technically if you follow the theory that this is uh Giovanni's son, then I guess that would make sense. Because like he wants revenge, you know. So we're gonna pit our little um, flying types against each other. And I'm just gonna keep it interesting like that. Because personally, this would oh shit. You know what? You know what? Oh fuck. Never mind. Never mind. I'm just gonna lay into this guy. MVP, I don't know what is going on lately, but you gotta knock this shit off. Otherwise, I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace you with my shiny venonat or something. Uh. All right, what the hell? Get him naked. Ew. I just listened to what I just said for like a second. Uh, don't don't start this shit. You're not losing to Lindsay after the shitting all over everybody. Every major opponent we just annihilated in the past like two videos. Three actually. Okay, come on. Magnemite. Okay, he still has a magnemite for some reason. I guess people don't start using magneton because apparently it's way too intense. <sighs> oh man, yeah, okay. Alright, I have work at 5 30. And it's 3 o'clock in the morning. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. I don't even know why I'm recording right now. And after I get done recording this video, I'm just gonna save it and render it. Because I like to do that all in one shot, just so it's done. Not only that, I'm worried about it. Okay, I think Sandy needs to chill the fuck out. Who is he sending out? Shit, I missed it. I'm gonna take a wild guess. And I'm gonna put out... Struggle. Oops. Hey, is that a... Is that a shiny? Sneasel? It is, I think. I think it is. Well, shit. Alright. We can deal. We can deal. Whatevs. 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 I swear to God, if he beats me. 
I mean, he won't, but... Okay, let's thunder wave this motherfucker. He's gonna get annoying really quick with that shit. Man, how'd you get a Sneasel? I want a Sneasel. I think Sneasel was really cool. I remember I have this really, um, this really old trading card game book. And it shows all, like, the, uh, the Pokemon cards and stuff. And it had previews of the new ones. And you could, like, call a number and order. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay. You're dead. Get out of here. But, yeah, and... It had very few of the second generation cards coming out. And I thought it was the coolest fucking thing. And I that's I always associate Sneasel with that, because Sneasel was one of those Pokemon. It's like, oh look, dark Pokemon. And I was like, oh shit, that's so cool. I was like I was like marking it. I was stoked for those dark type Pokemon coming out and those new cards. Man, I looked through that, I was like, I gotta buy it. And they were like twenty bucks just for one card, something like that. I wanted them so bad, it was ridiculous. Yeah, use curse, I'm gonna switch out. Uh, yeah, you're dead. I'm gonna put a curse on me, okay, that's not gonna do shit, but thanks. Quilava. You know what? Squidward, since you haven't bought this douche canoe yet. It's been a while since we fought him. It's been quite a while. Oh. Oh, man. I want a cool lava right now. It's not fair. Why'd I have to pick Struggle? Struggle... Struggle, I don't even know why I threw him out. I was just like, Struggle, you need your time to shine. Okay, he's gonna ease up, and he's and he doesn't understand why he lost. Well, kid, it, it's a thing called being ginger, and it's hard for you to, you know, raise Pokemon because they don't respect you. So they look at you and they're like, "Oh, that kid has red hair. I don't have to listen to him." All right, guys, I'm gonna cut it off here because I'm up to 22, and I don't know how much shit I'm gonna show, but this will probably be cut down to at least 15 minutes, and I think that's pretty good. So, I will see you guys next time, and we will do this fucking puzzle that I don't remember how to do, and it's gonna be like uh, the 7th gin all over again. See ya.